Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today we're going to show you how to load a custom ROM on the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. Okay, so before you begin, you must have done our how to root the Samsung Galaxy Nexus procedure. Uh, if you haven't, click on that link there to be taken to that. Fill, uh, finish that procedure completely and then you can come back to this one to continue. Okay, so now first thing we need to do is we need to flash a custom recovery image. So to do that on this device, we're going to go to the market search for ROM manager, click on the free one, and then click install, accept and download. Then we can click open. Okay, then we're gonna do flash clockwork mod recovery at the very top. Select your phone, we have the Galaxy Nexus. Hit allow. Should say successfully flashed. Click okay. Okay, so now the next step uh, is to find a ROM that we want to download and install. So you're gonna click on our ROM section there, link, and scroll down to your manufacturer and ultimately your device. And then click on that and then choose whichever ROM you want and then save that ROM to your computer. Okay, and while the ROM is downloading, you're gonna plug in your device via USB. Pull down the top here, and just make sure it is connected as a media device. Okay, and then, then we're going to open our device's internal storage on our computer, and we're also gonna find where we saved our ROM file. Make sure you leave it as a .zip file, whatever the ROM is, and we're just gonna copy it over to the root of our internal storage, which means not inside any of these folders, just on the internal storage itself. And we're gonna wait for that to transfer. And then we can unplug our device once the rom.zip file is saved uh, to our phone. And then we're gonna turn off our phone. And once it's off completely, give it a few seconds. We're gonna hold down both volume buttons at the same time and hold down power till we get to our mode here. Then we're gonna use these volume buttons here to select recovery mode and hit power and wait for it to boot into recovery mode. And in recovery mode, we're gonna use the volume buttons to scroll down to backup and storage and hit power to select. Then select backup by hitting power again. And wait for it to backup your current uh, system software just in case you wanna revert back to it or in case something goes wrong. Once it says backup complete, we can then go to wipe data factory reset Yes, wait for it to do that really quick. And then install zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card, and now we're gonna select our ROM file. So I have this one here, like that, and then hit yes. And wait for it to install that. And now once it says install from SD card complete, and go down to go back, and then reboot system now and wait for the device to reboot. Okay, and then once uh, it reboots, you should be at the setup screen for your new custom ROM. Uh, if you wanna load a different ROM, simply just repeat this procedure with downloading a different ROM, uh, starting at the point where it asks you to download a ROM in the procedure. Uh, other than that, you can also check out some of our other how-to videos for the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. We do also have a how-to uh, load Google Wallet on the device, uh, amongst other procedures. 
uh, at the time of writing this, Google Wallet is not available for the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. This is the only way to get it on is to kind of root your device and load it a, a different way. So feel free to check that one out and some of the other ones we have uh, and enjoy. Thank you.